Welcome back, Matthews fam. Can I say that? Even though like my handle is not the Matthews fam, it's We Are Dan and Sam. But I feel like I can say that. We Are Dan and Sam fam, that's kind of weird. All right, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> So I am in our client's rig. It's a Grand Design travel trailer, model number 312BHTS. And I'm gonna share some before photos because this does not look anything like it did when we got it. Very dark and dingy and cold feeling and ugly. And our clients wanted something that's bohemian, farmhouse, um, real cozy with warmth, something that they can enjoy when they travel to the desert and the lake, um, and it feel like home on the road. So let's get to it and i'm going to show you the after and i hope you guys like it this was definitely um i don't know probably my favorite by far to be honest i mean honestly everyone that we do gets better and better but can't wait to show you guys share all the details anything that i explain link wise will be down in the, in the description um and yeah let's go all right so welcome to the main living area of the green design reflection I'm gonna start out over here on the dining room side. So originally this had a bench seat with the table in the middle and our clients wanted an L-shaped bench with storage underneath just to fit more people. And so I used the original table. It's sanded and stained and looks so good. The stain is special walnut. And then these chairs are metal and they are from Amazon, perfect for indoor outdoor use and with travel trailer or with RV life, RV, travel you have to have stuff that's multi-functional and so the fact that they can use these inside and outside is a plus the bamboo shades are from amazon super cute add nice warmth here the light is from amazon the curtains are target and the curtain rods are walmart and then all the um place setting is from target pillows from tj maxx Probably one of my favorite areas over here is the couch. So this is from Albany Park Home, super comfy. It is the Kova couch and it's actually like a sectional that you can kind of piece together. So these are two armless sections that we just put together um, and we use every inch of space possible <laughs> to make the most of it and just give a lot of seating area. And the rust pillow is from Target and the white one is from TJ Maxx. The little poof ottoman is from Amazon. So anything on Amazon is linked in my storefront down below is the description. This little um, storage entertainment area, whatever you wanna call it on this side. The cabinets we left original, we just painted them with muslin bolt from Sherwin-Williams and the handles um, are from Amazon. And then this adorable um, wallpaper is from Spoonflower or you can find it um, on Amazon as well and then for the countertops we used it's called strata it's like a marble a faux marble from Lowe's really gives it that high scale feel cute barn door so these are are the original sliders that we just added stained shiplap to and the barn door handles are from Amazon gives it that farmhouse feel for the entertainment area, we kept the original frame. We decided to take this cabinet out and do a little birch logs there. Makes it feel more cozy. And then the TV pushes down into the countertop to create a seamless counter just for space for cooking. And kept the original appliances. We have a coffee bar over here with some floating shelves, the or faux floating shelves. The brackets are from Amazon, some cute sconce lighting farmhouse sink with a big island for extra seating and then the faucet and the sink are from Amazon all right we'll work our way in the bunk room so here we have three beds in the bunk room this does not look the same as it did before it's so crazy how different it looks and how good it looks so we took out the steps that were here um, not my favorite added a cute little ladder again staying with the um, special walnut and on the beds is Betty's so I don't know if you have heard of Betty's or we use them in our house but they are perfect for RV life so it is a full sheet a fitted sheet and a comforter blanket all in one so it goes on like a fitted sheet and all you do is unzip it you pull the little flap of the sheet out and you are ready for bed 
that's it. And when you make the bed, it's super easy because you just tuck it into the edge. No jumping over, trying to get it tucked, trying to get it perfect without like pulling it off. And when you're done and you want to make the bed in the morning, you just tuck the sheet in and unzip it. So there's a code in the description that you can use for 15% off your order. And honestly, I am sold on them. They're so great. So here is the bed all folded out and it is a full bed. The mattress is from Mattress Insider. And so it's actually a bifold mattress. So we had them custom make it. It's all organic gel foam, super comfy and soft. And then in the middle, there's just a seam here where the mattress folds. That way you can use it for a couch or a bed, whatever you need it for. The curtains, the fabric is from Ikea and the leather snaps um, are from Amazon. I made them and look how fun they are. I'm gonna add the leather snaps here, but so cute and you just use dowel rods to hook them up. We put some faux beams in here. So instead of framing them out and like capping and making them drop down, it's just a stained two by four. So it gives the illusion of beams without losing a lot of headspace. And we continue the beams all the way through the RV into the master. But I'll stop and show you the bathroom. Again, that gorgeous wallpaper. The mirror and shelf is from um, Amazon. And then the plant is from TJ Maxx. We have a faucet and sink from Amazon as well. And then we did a butcher stain butcher block for the countertops. Shower curtain from Target. And then look at this fun bathroom or shower so the shower system is from Amazon and then the tile is Duma wall tiling um, from Amazon as well super easy to install very user friendly and then instead of the medicine cabinet in the back we decided to do some baskets for storage and they did want a new toilet so this is a ceramic toilet from Dometic again a barn door slider we added some cute pegs in the hall those are from Amazon and then frames from frame it easy um, it's acrylic instead of glass, and so it's awesome for RV. Just in case they fall down, they don't shatter. Um, very good quality, and again, in the, the description is a link that you can purchase for 10% off. So in the master, we have Betty's again. We decided to paint the storage in here and then do some stained shiplap as the headboard. We did those curtains as well with the leather snaps, some storage here. And then in there is hookups for washer and dryer, but it's just additional closet space. All right, well, there you have it. That is our client's rig. 2017 Grand Design Reflection Model 312 BHTS. Um, that's a long name, but hope you guys liked it. Stay tuned for more. We have a fifth wheel that we're working on and we'll show you guys that after in probably two weeks and then you can go check out our other walkthroughs of a open range and um, a Keystone Summerlin travel trailer. You can follow all behind the scenes on Instagram and TikTok at We Are Dan and Sam and don't forget to subscribe to this video to stay updated on what's next and we'll talk to you guys later.